Ladies and gentlemen, we have a short video clip for our opening. Our world has been going through a period where new economic dynamics emerge every day. While global trade is reshaping through digital transformation, new trade corridors emerge. Within this process of change, Turkey continues its claim to be the most competent country to manage the economic and commercial diplomacy of its region. International Corporation Platform, which was established in 2009 based on this opinion, has been performing various activities in many fields including economy, politics, science, technology, and culture, with the aim of contributing to the creation of strategic alliances that would benefit from the opportunities offered by the global economy. The platform, which was established by prominent experts that have invaluable experiences in politics and diplomacy, emphasizes the importance of acting together to ensure a sustainable and balanced economy and performs professional activities that shape the global agenda by bringing together all decision makers in politics, business world, civil society, and social arena. International Corporation Platform defines its operating principles in eight main statements. One, leading the region in solution through political dialogue and diplomacy. Two, creating mutual economic cooperation opportunities and making joint investments for stability and sustainability. Three, expanding freedoms. Four, relying on human-based law as well as the universal principles of law. Five, ensuring stability and reliability. Six, enabling the free movement of goods, products, and people. Seven, removing the obstacles and borders among the countries of the region. Eight, increasing the participation of women entrepreneurs in the business world. In addition to the successful professional activities it carries out, International Corporation Platform brings together the reputable politicians, investors and entrepreneurs of the region and the world at the Bosphorus Summit every year. This year, the 10th Bosphorus Summit will be held based on the Towards a New World Order theme focused on the human-centered development topic within the framework of inclusiveness, technology, ethics, and governance concepts. At the summit, young leaders and business people of the region where Turkey is also located will share their opinions in wide range of topics including mega projects that facilitate the human life by using technology and science, international trade conditions, banking, exportation, and customs operations. Under the topics such as sustainable development models, energy and environmental investments, cooperation in defense industry, and alternative investment opportunities, various projects that would sculpt the future of the world will be discussed at the 10th Bosphorus Summit. Boğaziçi Zirvesi'nin Yedincisinin başarılarla dolu olmasını temenni ediyorum. We are honored to host distinguished speakers and participants from more than 90 countries at the 10th Bosphorus Summit, organized by the International Cooperation Platform under the auspices of the President of the Republic of Turkey. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first day of Phosphorus Summit 2019. Now I would kindly like to invite the founder of International Cooperation Platform, Cengiz Özgencil, for his opening speech.
değerli devlet adamları, iş dünyasının saygıdeğer konukları, çok değerli basın mensupları, 10. Boğaziçi Zirvesi'ne hoş geldiniz. Bugün içinde olduğumuz ekonomik ve siyasi problemler, jeopolitik konumundan ötürü sadece Türkiye'yi ve komşularını değil, tüm dünyayı etkilemektedir. Bu duruma karşı duyarsız kalmayan toplum, sürekli kaydettiği gelişimin yanında, yaşanan insani kaybı ve yıkımı sorgulamayı da sürdürmektedir. Açıkça görülüyor ki dünya yeni bir düzene, yeni bir toplum, toplumsallığa doğru gitmektedir. Daha eşitlikçi, hukuk devletini göz ardı etmeyen, ekolojik vaziyete dikkat eden, doğanın yağmalanmasına izin vermeyen, aşırı tüketimden kaçan bir düşünce biçimi, yeni toplumsal duyarlılığı bizlere hissettirmektedir. Biz de önümüzdeki üç gün boyunca 30'u aşkın panelde çok değerli siyasetçiler, düşünür, düşünürler, iş insanları ve medya mensuplarıyla yeni dünya düzenine dair fikirler üretmeyi hedefliyoruz. Boğaziçi zirvesi olarak geçtiğimiz yıllarda dünya barışına dair pek çok önemli paylaşımlarda bulunulmasına vesile olduk. 10. yılımızı ger gerçekleştiriyor olmanın mutluluğuyla bu senede İstanbul'dan Boğaziçi Zirvesi'nden çıkacak tüm çözüm odaklı düşüncelerin dünyaya yayılmasını diliyorum. Hepinize tekrar teşekkür ediyor, saygılarımı sunuyorum.